Hello and welcome to How to Lose at Downwell, episode 2. Today we're going to get past the catacombs. We're going to quit getting bit by the blue enemies of yore. Cavern 1. So yeah, these guys, that's our arch nemeses. Guys that are completely colored. Those are the ones that have killed me the most. Um, yeah, just hopping on heads, baby. Getting in the rhythm. Let's see if I can get a combo going today. I, um, I went back and I watched part of the trailer for this game on Steam. And, uh, combos. They, uh, really, really dwelt on the combo aspect of it. And that is something I did not achieve at all. But I want to get combos going, and I got a five combo. That's good. Good start. But we're just getting started, baby. Bonk, bonk, bonk. It's not so hard. Let's find out what our first item is, or first perk is. It's sucking in nearby gems. Getting gems causes a bullet to shoot up with a drone. You know, let's go with the drone, buddy. My good friend. I'm not alone, and I have a drone. I got hit, and I'm okay with that. Down to three out of four health. Um, hmm. Yikes, another all-colored item enemy. Um, let's do it. Get some charge out of the health that we're gonna take. Um, it's a matter of maintaining momentum, you know? I want positive momentum, and I want to not keep stepping on these evil eyes. I missed a gem, and I went back for it, because that's just the kind of guy I am. Okay, I'm like the shepherd who won't let the sheep. Okay. I got punished for my hubris there, and that's all right. Yikes! Turtle of evil. I'm losing momentum fast. I don't like it. None of these give me HP. Let's take a look here. Let's switch the blast module. Stomp on some enemies. You know, the first... I was just warming up, man. We're just warming up. Let's not dwell on this. Let's keep it going. Um, we're gonna keep it that. I'm gonna keep swapping styles. What? No. Uh, palette. That's what I meant. We didn't try this yet. Yeah, that's a, that's a little bold. At least... The colors are easy enough to see. A little much. Um. Shotgun, okay. Just realized I was using the circle pad. I'm gonna stick to the D pad as much as I can. And by circle pad, I meant the control stick. Yeah, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Now I missed the shop, possibly. That was probably just an item room. Um, but, you know, let's not get discouraged. This could be an apple in the first perk. Yep. Whatever. Feels like a waste of a perk, but it keeps the run alive. Um... trying to get a combo going and it's it's punishing me. Alright, let's not tilt too hard. Machine gun. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, 
tank. Okay. Well, back to the commentary. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and get rocket jump. Yeah. Let's switch the pallet and try one more run. This doesn't appear to be our day. Um, let's think for a second. So... I think it's just a matter of focus. And we're gonna try it. We're gonna get that focus back. I will... I will destroy this. The catacombs got nothing on me. Um, focus unless I'm getting sick combos. Just bonking enemies. Getting some gems. Um. So it looks, I mean, bonking an enemy's nog gets us the reload back, right? So I can, I can uh, basically use my gun more than I have been. basically a jetpack. Um, just learning a thing or two about the game here. Get that gem high started. Consume dead bodies to gain health. Lift off. The gun module to reshuffle at once. You know what? I'm gonna try this and I'm going to try my best to eat these dead bods. Okay, I just ate him. But I didn't get health back right away at least. Okay. So it seems by just standing on the dead bods, I have a chance to get health back. not feeding me fast enough. Alright. You gotta heal me, buddy. Okay. Get that gem. Step on that guy's nog. Okay. Nope. We're, we're running. That bird almost killed us. And I just got health back from consume... Okay, it says om nom nom when I actually get health back. Got it. We're learning. Ouch. Every time I say we're learning, we get hit. Even then, when I said the deadly words in reference to the new knowledge that the idea of learning... Yeah, learning. I said learning, he eats me. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well... <clears throat> I'm not giving up quite yet. Nuclear, I wonder if that's a reference to, uh, Nuclear Throne. And I'm, I'm gonna find out right now. This looks more like Fallout Boy, or <laughs> Fallout. Fallout Boy. Okay. Yep. Here we go. Gotta get that momentum. Positive momentum started. Get in the swing of things. This is not the easiest game that exists. That would be, um, I don't know. Probably haven't played it. Maybe Kirby, uh, or even Wii. That is, that is pretty easy. Alright. Let's just trying to remember. What's the easiest game that I've ever played? I don't know. What's the easiest game that you've ever played? You don't really remember the easy ones. It's harder it's a lot easier to remember the hard ones, which is a hard sentence to say. 
Candle. Hmm. The fact is, I take damage enough to warrant this. Um. Hey, bird. Shut the heck up. Okay. I'm starting to get a feel for which which guns are better for jetpacks, which are better for hurting enemies and whatnot. This gun seems like it's trying to be a blend of both, but it's more on the enemy side. Um, I'll try the car battery. Why not? Looks like I can fire four times now, if I couldn't already. Shut up. Certainly not going to say the L word. Thank you for the life, the laser. Thank you for the life and the laser. This one is definitely on the enemy side. Ow! And like the mining side, basically a, a clear downward spiral. That's what we're on. <laughs> uh. Let's try our drone friend again. I think he works better with, uh, like a machine gun weapon. Because he seems to fire one regular bullet every time you fire a machine gun. And that's, that's gonna be it for Downwell Episode 2. How to lose at Downwell. I think I've definitely shown you how to lose at Downwell today.